Hello, and thank you for contacting the service desk. My name is Chris, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to add a mailbox into your Outlook. Now, what I mean by that is often within an organization, people have to access what are called shared mailboxes. This might be a mailbox that's used by an entire team or just a couple of individuals. And this also applies to if somebody has assigned you delegate rights, meaning that another user within your organization has given you permission to access their mailbox. After they've done that, a lot of people call in and say, hey, I don't see anything. And that's because you need to manually add that inbox into your Outlook. And we're going to go through that. It's a couple of steps here. I feel like there's a few more than there probably should be, but that's a Microsoft thing. But fortunately, these steps are very easy to do. So if you'll just follow along with me, we're going to go ahead and add a mailbox of one of my colleagues into my Outlook. What we need to do is navigate up here to the top left hand corner and click file click account settings and then click account settings from the menu that pops out of that button there select your email address from the list you likely only have your email address listed in here but if there are others just select the, your own and then click the change button then from this change account window go ahead and click the more settings button down near the bottom right hand corner of the window in a moment you'll see the Microsoft Exchange window pop up here click the advanced tab and click add I'm going to go ahead and add my colleague here, David Wolf, and I can just type his name or I can type his email address in this box. Click OK. It's going to resolve the name here. It successfully found it and added David Wolf there. Click Apply. Click OK. And then click Next back here on the Change Account window. It'll take a moment for things to update, and then you'll get the Finish button, which you can click, and then you can close this window out. If we look over here at the navigation tree where we have all of our folders listed, we'll see now that David Wolf is listed down here at the bottom. Click the caret to expand out the folders. Now, David hasn't given me delegate access rights to his mailbox, so we don't see anything listed here. So if you add a mailbox and nothing pops up, chances are you don't have permission to view that mailbox as I don't have permission, David's permission to access his inbox right now. But had he done that, had he assigned us delegate rights or we had had permission to a shared mailbox that we added, we would see the folders listed right below it inbox sent um, all those folders that you're normally used to seeing under your mailbox they'd all be available right under there and that's it that's how you add an additional mailbox into your outlook thank you very much if you need further assistance please reach out to the service desk you can find our number on the company intranet site feel free to give us a call send us an email or contact us by chat thank you very much and have a great day